Hey everybody, this is Tiff's vlog. This is part two. Um, the only things I really want to talk about today is I have a lateralis baby population explosion. I'm up to 428 babies. I created an incubator a couple weeks ago and it's had like really good success. Um, I keep getting babies hatched every single day. Uh, so that's working out really well. So check out my videos on my incubator. I have two videos about that and it helps out a lot if you want to keep your little baby lateralis safe. Um, also I have some sad news. My Neoscana crucifera or weaver spider, Lacey, is dying. But I did discover today that she had laid an egg sac. So I will have baby orb weavers. Um, that's the only good thing about her passing on is that, you know, she's left me a future generation. So hopefully the sack's good and babies will show up. Um, Pumpkin, my rabid wolf spider, her babies finally hatched. Um, I've been waiting for a while on that. And they're all piled up on her back. So in about a month, uh, I will have those guys up for sale. They're going to be $5 each. If you get multiples, I'll cut you a deal. Um, and they're rabid wolf spiders. They're a really neat looking uh, wolf spider. They have a lighter color with some really neat striping and they're pretty good size. Um, nice looking spiders. I also have for sale uh, Venones ornata, which is the ornate harvestman. Uh, it's a type of daddy long legs and they're, they're really cool. I've got a video about that as well if you check that out. Um, let's see, I have Halloween Hissers, a bunch of them still waiting for babies. I have Wide Horn Hissers, I'm waiting for babies. Um, I've got baby, lots of baby stuff today. I've got little Phidippus Audax, which is the bold or daring jumping spider. I have babies right now, uh, those are going to be a couple dollars a piece. And I also sell my homemade roach chow, which is good for roaches, crickets, any type of insect that eats the chow. Uh, it's a, my own formula, and it enhances color, and it, it's a really good food. Uh, I do a small bag for $4, which is like a sandwich bag, and then a larger bag, which is like three of those bags for $10. Um, so if anybody's interested in that, please contact me there. And within the next few months, I should have more roaches and things for sale. Right now, I'm just building up my breeding colonies and everything. So I don't have a whole lot for sale or anything right now. Um, sometimes I do do trades, depending upon what people have and what they want from me. So if you're interested in anything, just contact me. I have 112... Uh, Oxyhaloa duestas now. I started off with 18, um, had one litter of 18, and then it just skyrocketed from there. So those guys, I'll have some of those for sale soon. They're a little, a small roach, like a black purplish color with a small little cherry tomato looking head. And they're cool because they come out during the day. Um, a nice roach to watch. Uh, let me think what else has been happening. Uh, this isn't roach news, but one of my reptiles. I have three box turtles that were rescues. And the one is an adult. It, my neighbor brought it to me. Um, we thought it was a male this whole time because it's really brightly colored and has like male coloration and everything. So we named it Leo. Well, Leo had some eggs, so it's definitely a female. Um, this turtle was hit by a car, had some uh, neurological damage and a, a shell fracture and we're nursing her back to health and apparently she was pregnant before she got hit so there's three little turtle eggs this is eastern box turtle and I'm going to see if they hatch um, in about two and a half to three months I've got them incubating right now so we're anxious to see if Leo's little babies survive um, she's a really nice turtle and I hope her babies live I hope they're fertile um, other than that, that's really all that's been going on. Lots of baby spiders, uh, lots of baby roaches, a uh, few things for sale. You guys can also check out my Facebook page, uh, Tiff's Bugs and More. 
Uh, you guys can join that. I keep like updates of what's going on and put up pictures and everything. Um, so yeah, this is Tips Vlog Episode 2. If you have any questions or comments, please message me. Uh, I love you guys. Uh, keep watching my videos and stay tuned for more. Alright, bye-bye.